So hello, uh, Florence, you are you were 10 years old in May. Hello, mum as well. And you're seeing me about selective eating and really you're living off um, carby stuff plus uh, you like peas, you like uh, chicken nuggets and roast chicken. So apart from peas and carrots, then we're looking for more uh, vegetables. So you've really got you know, homemade pancakes at the moment, rice cakes, apple and apple juice, roast dinner, pizza. At the moment, I'm obviously looking to expand that. You, your main block in the way you told me was gagging. Even if you taste a little bit of something, you tend to gag, which obviously puts you off trying food. Um, and according to your mum, this happened pre-weaning. And one idea was that you had this high fever, so you're already in a very distressed state. Your mum squirted a bit of this uh, medicine down it. Uh, you may have you know, been surprised, may have choked, and then it could have happened from that. It's a good theory. Yeah? Or it could have happened from meconium issues that your mum said, okay. If I had to bring the food you brought in today here, right now, to say, you know, go ahead and try a bit, what would you say to me at the moment? You wouldn't want to, and you wouldn't be able to. You know, if I said, well, you know, could you say, I just, I just can't. I'm, I'm incapable of trying it now. Fair, yeah. great. She was so, quite nervous when we, when she saw what I bought this morning. Oh, really? You're very nervous when you're watching it, and obviously that's fear there. So there's fear at the moment with foods. It's very clear. And if at the end of the session you're eating it calmly, you know for a fact something will change. Yeah. Okay. Great. Thank you. Hello again, Florence. We've just finished our session. So we've got the food prepared, we've got a yogurt, some fruit, a sandwich, some, uh, grapes. some grapes and some spaghetti bolognese somewhere, yeah. Yeah? yeah? Great. So, if you would like to come have a look, what's the easiest food for you to start with first? Oh, some orange juice. And orange juice. Oh, yeah. Lovely. I'll try yeah. You're starting with orange juice, are you? Nice. Zingy. Zingy, Zingy. Zingy yeah. isn't it? Okay. Um, melon, grape, yogurt. Mango. Are they seedless? Yeah. Okay, good. Yeah. So a little bit juicy, a bit sweet. Head nod of approval. Good. If you're on a fruit watermelon, theme. Watermelon, you yeah. particularly wanted to try more watermelon, didn't you? Yeah. So this is a bit like some kind of uh, slushy. <laughs> it's really, really nice. What is it called? Slush. Slush. So it's so. mm -hmm. yeah. Trying it, no problem there. Mango is very hard to pick up. <laughs> it's a bit right. slippery. Yeah. If it's soft, it's right. So you want the soft bit. If it's yeah. Soft bit. That one looks a bit hard. You try that one. And then it's, yeah, make sure it's not too ripe on the other side of the spectrum. Do you want to take a little bite, Mum, just to make sure it's uh, it's a nice one? Yeah. Nice one. Mm. That nice one. Great. Yeah. Bit yeah, it's kind of hard slippery. to hold. Slippery. I got some tissues there. Zingy so. and sweet. A bit like orange juice. Mm -hmm. So so. It's slightly got a texture, hasn't it? It's got a slightly fibrous yeah. texture. Strawberry yogurt. It's got bits of strawberry in by looking, mm. so you might have like little tiny strawberry yeah. seeds, you know, like on the strawberry. Can you start blue? Yeah. Red. Yeah. Hmm. See. Hey, yeah. Have another, like it. have a bigger spoonful. Hmm. Very nice. Very nice. Healthier than Kit Kat. <laughs> Gonna have a yogurt to go with your lunch. But also, yeah. you, yeah. you 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 like swallowed all of those things. Oh yeah, you there noticed. is that. <laughs> yeah. Awesome. So you just had one, two, three, four things, five yeah. things of the juice in like fewer than five minutes. It's pretty cool, isn't it? That's proof. How Something. Is that? You really, yeah. really like the strawberry yogurt? There's so many nice yogurts there too. I think you like the blueberry yogurt.
bit and strawberry. Exactly. Hmm. Exactly. But you know it's you. So now we're preparing the spaghetti bolognese. Dark in my kitchen. Did you make this, Mum? Yeah. yeah. Great. Homemade. The best kind. It smells really good. It does smell nice, doesn't it? It smells really good too. So this is without the grated cheese. Let's see if I got it. Yeah. Try and get some light. Yeah. Give it a blow in case it's hot. Yeah. That's really nice. Well, you've done spaghetti bolognese things. Yeah. That's amazing. Yeah. But just grabbing off you. <laughs> <laughs> Give me back my spaghetti. That's right. a really good family meal that yeah. we can all eat together. Yeah. And bolognese, of course, you have jack of potatoes and chili con carne, yeah. and rice. So suddenly it's opened up a lot of possibilities. Awesome. <laughs> I really like the taste of the um, bolognese. bolognese. But it's good. It's good. But you can have the bolognese like that. Philip can you can put say, it you can on have toast. It on a baked potato. Yeah. So, like you can have it not on anything really. You can put it on toast if you want. Yeah. yeah. That's what I do with leftovers. Right, leftover yeah. bolognese. You put it on toast. Really nice also. Toasted thing. So um, do, you, do you need to try it with a bit of rice on or um, rice cheese on or? Do you want to try it with a bit of cheese? I'll try it with a bit of cheese. Yeah. Okay. The grate is in my bag. Then. Okay. Let's pause. I didn't turn it with cheese when I did it before. It's nice just cheddar cheese or how is that? It's just cheddar cheese. Just cheddar, okay. I like cheddar. Oh, you like cheddar. And you like bolognese, so let's try them together. I think it's even nicer with the cheese. Is it good? Mm -hmm. Lovely. Really nice. Excellent. So are we are we convinced change has taken place today? You were nervous before, kind of smiling now. I'll share that. <laughs> thanks. Great. And thanks for this. Um, it does inspire other people who see this. So uh, great job. Great job. How are you, Mum, with everything? Like slightly teary. Oh, sweet. <laughs> That's amazing. That's amazing. Thank you. Okay. Thanks for, um, again, for this being on YouTube.